chemist. I have lived with Abby for two years. She's 22 years old. Abby looks like a 12 year old and she acts like a 12 year old. Abby, seriously, would you stop it? Mmm, <laughs> swamp test it. This is our room, and most importantly, this is my blankie. Abby cannot live without her blankie. And it's very, very nice. I love my blankie, and I cannot sleep without it at night. I have to have it. I've had my blankie since I was a baby. Her blankie is her bedtime pal. She grips that blanket all night long. If it's gone, I suddenly wake up. A couple of months ago, I decided to steal Abby's blankie, and I hid it from her. I said, Buzz, I really need it, and I was about to cry. Where did you put it, Buzz? I'm serious. That really pushed her over the edge. Finally, when she was able to find the blankie, she slept like a baby. This is my sleeping bag. Kind of has some holes, but I love it. Abby began sleeping in a sleeping bag because she didn't know how to make her bed. Abby's favorite pajamas are her footsie pajamas, like little kids wear. Her favorite TV shows are cartoons like Shrek and SpongeBob. Well, I think I stepped in something. Abby has never had a boyfriend. I get kind of shy around guys. I've thought about if my blankie would interfere if I got married. If Dr. Phil could get me a guy that also sleeps with a blankie, that would totally rock my socks off. Dr. Phil, help my roommate to grow up. She's been obsessed with her blankie since she was born. What's she gonna do when she gets married?